This is a procedure that's done to salvage a young arthritic knee. Essentially, a young patient who is physically very active and has developed arthritis, most commonly in the medial compartment. So here's a long leg x-ray of a patient that I have done a high tibial osteotomy on. As you can see, the patient has narrowing of the joint space on the medial compartment as opposed to the lateral side. So I'm just going to make that a bit bigger for you so you can see what I'm talking about. And here we are. As you can see, the lateral space is a lot bigger than the medial space. So essentially, the patient is medial compartment osteoarthritis. And now when I go back and draw a line from the femoral head right all the way down, oops, sorry, to the ankle over here, you can see that this line goes through the inner aspect of the knee joint. So there's more force or more weight going through the inside of the knee as the patient walks. So the idea of the high tibial osteotomy is to unload the medial compartment. How do we do that? So we have to move this ankle over to this point. So when we draw a line from the top of the femur, all the way to the ankle, the line would go to the outside of the knee. So here I have a x-ray that I've taken on a patient that has already had this procedure done. So here is the high tibial osteotomy. I've opened up a wedge in the top of the femur. And this is the long leg x-ray of the same patient drawing the same line from the femur to the ankle. Now that line goes on the outside of the knee joint, not the inside. So it essentially opens the knee joint on the inside, relieving the pressure of the knee joint on the inside, hence relieving the pain. This osteotomy takes six weeks to heal up or start healing up, and at about the three month mark, the patient is ready back to go to sports and work. So you can see that this operation is a very good operation for the young arthritic patient who does not want to have a knee replacement as in a knee replacement we actually reset bone and it's an irreversible operation with a high tibial osteotomy you can always go on to have a knee replacement thank you